because I'm Linnea, one of your team advisors. What I'm going to do today is a party game. Uh, basically, the whole reason for games is to get women interactive with you, have fun, but I want to do a little bit of a different party game with you. This can be used to help educate your women at the party, it can be used to help upsell, and it's a wonderful thing to use for bar gigs or um, big parties that are um, for men and women. I get a lot of people asking me, how do you do your bar gigs? What do you, kind of games do you play? What do you do? I don't know what I'm doing. This can help you, but you can play it at any game. It's basically pure romance trivia. It's super easy, and I have this right on PR Red Hot's group. You can just print it off, maybe put it on your index cards, and go from there. And what I give out for prizes for those of the women or men that answer correctly is a card. For any of you that were at the meeting last month, you know that I use playing cards to hand out, and at the end of the demo or show, I pick a playing card just off the top of my head, like say Queen of Hearts or something like that, and that person wins my prize. My prize is usually like a coupon with uh, some chocolates with my name on it and some penis toppers, whatever. That's the grand prize. So this is what we're gonna do is trivia, and I'm gonna kind of focus right along over here and hand you out playing cards. I'll probably call them tickets a million times, but I'm just so used to calling them that. So we're gonna do trivia, ladies, and you can find this right on PR Red Hots or Naz Naughties if you're on my team. Okay, so can everyone hear me? Yeah. Yes. yes! All right, so trivia questions. I love this. If you actually are doing a bar gig, something you might want to do is, what I, I went to the dollar store, Dollar Tree specifically, and I got those little um, $1 bill uh, things. They come with like a hundred in a pack for a dollar. I'm like, <laughs> I'm going to laminate these. So for my bar gigs, when they answer a trivia question correctly, they get a dollar. Yay! I don't like to give out money, but bar gigs, it's tough to get sales. So you're trying to amp that up a little bit. So when I'm doing a bar gig, bar gig, if they answer a trivia question correctly, they get a dollar. What they get to do with this little laminated dollar, which by the way, has all my information on the back, <laughs> wink, wink, and recruiting information, they get to use that off their order. But at a regular party, just basic party, I will hand out my playing cards or like Jenna likes to do, what are they? The, um, the date night cards, love that. I'm probably gonna switch to that. So first question, now this is an upselling tool for me. I know it's a little boring, you feel like you're in school, but it's actually really nice for you to upsell and you would wanna play other games in addition to this. So first question, what best selling female pop star of the 80s and 90s said losing my virginity was a career move? Raise your hand if you think you know. Whoa, hey, raise your hand, woman. You, you're the best Chelsea said her. Yes, yes, Madonna, you're right. We all shouted it out. Thanks. Woo! Raise your hand, ladies. Woo! We're in school for like the next I can first. Five minutes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I love that you said that, because guess what? What? We sell like a virgin. <laughs> it makes it feel like the second time you got not the first time. We all know that hurts. So if you want to be like Madonna, like a virgin. I'll talk about that in the ordering room with me. I will hook you up. So, next question. Over 30% of men suffer. Now think. Wait, think. Don't think about what's on TV. Just think about this. Over 30% of men suffer from this sexual dysfunction or impairment. What is it? Go. Premature ejaculation. You rock girl. Absolutely. Wonderful. Most people say erectile dysfunction. Actually, just about like maybe 10% or more of men suffer from that, so that is not correct. We do have something, time check, we do have something for that. It's called Up All Night that will help desensitize them just enough to keep it going last longer. In the United States, what is the most common STD? Raise your hands. No. Human papilloma virus. Nope. Herpes. Chlamydia. Herpes, yes. <laughs> What three body parts, specifically kind of sexual, do you have? What? What three body parts do you have if you have polyphilia? Nipples. Nipples, yes. Don't you worry. We have nipples. Plus a buddy for that. <laughs> plus a buddy will help stimulate your nipples and give you that headlight look in your lingerie. And if you have three of them, <laughs> it's okay. Plastic surgery works. <laughs> Oral sex, what is it? Gag. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Spit. 
They upset. They grow up. Swallow! Swallow! Yeah, don't worry about that. Don't make these gross. I know, you're not in the ice cream aisle like, aw oh, man, they're all the penis flavored ice cream. No. <laughs> so I got whipped or up, or I'm sorry, great head that will actually correct the taste of that. Correct! Yay! <laughs> You'll thank me later. So I know we're on a time check. This is just an example. Basically what you're doing is you're offering trivia questions, having them answer them, getting them engaging with you, making it fun, and you're upselling your products. What I'm upselling is lubes, condoms, pretty much everything we have just by these trivia questions. They are on the PR Red Hot team. You can look them up, you can put them on index cards if you have any further questions. Just ask me again, my name is Linnea Trevin. I will collect my cards and leave it up to the next advisor. Thank you, Lee.